Tournament of Roses Parade. News 8's Megan Munchman caught up with the band director and the musicians as they put the final touches on a show and experience, Megan, that they will never forget. Yeah, that's right. Rockford's marching band is already coming off of a great year, having won for the fifth year in a row the state's marching competition. And now it's on to sunny California for these Rams. There's no winter break for Rockford's marching band this year. These Rams ramp up practices and fine tune their performance ahead of their trip out west. The last time Rockford went to Pasadena was in 1986 under the direction of C. David Bass. Director of bands Brian Phillips says it's been a long and grueling process to land one of these coveted musical spots for his students. Written applications, video applications, uh, performance examples. But after almost a year in the making, these 50 or so students are headed to Hollywood, or Hollywood adjacent at least. I am very excited. I've never been on a trip before. I've actually never been on an airplane before, so well, that'll be very fun. Celia Ratke says she can't wait to bask in the sun and palm trees of the West Coast, and getting to do it alongside her friends is more than she could ever have hoped for. Rehearsals may be long and even tiring for some. Phillips wants to make sure his students are ready to give it their all on January 2nd for the Tournament of Roses Parade. We did actually create a little bit of a couch to parade program that hopefully most of the students are following because they will be moving for about six miles. Which is something that's not lost on Rapke or her fellow bandmates. Especially to play for that long, it's going to be tough, but hopefully we've practiced enough that we can get through it. The band heads west next week week and prior to their Rose Bowl performance, they'll get a couple of days to visit popular attractions like Disneyland and Universal.